Good evening, everyone. Everyone, I know it's kind of late. Well, not a little bit. It's about, uh, what time is it? It looks like it's about 10, 20, 10, 15 or 10, 20, something like that. I guess if I could put my glasses on, I could see it clearer. But anyway, it's at nighttime. And I haven't been too long or risen up from my nap. And uh, the only reason, I probably would have been asleep right now if uh, my niece hadn't came by to pick up something. And let me show you, let me show you this uh, <laughs> scene of the day, y'all. This is the scene of the day. Look at that fireplace. What is that? It looks like something that belongs outside the barbecue on. Let me see if I got a close-up of that. And they've got two different types of rugs. I mean, which it looks nice, though. I mean, I would have never thought to decorate like this. You know, you know me, I would have never. But I'm loving the background. I'm loving the window back here, you know, that you could see maybe a little cottage or something sitting out there in the back with the trees. This is this, this is nice. And that it's it's a nice bright room, you know? You really gotta see it for yourself. A book bookshelf over here. And that looks like a loft. It looks lofty. And that Christmas tree looks like a back in the day Christmas tree, I tell you. And the dog laying there on the rug, taking it easy, you know what I mean? Oh, wow. I ain't crazy about the scene, y'all. <laughs> I have to be perfectly honest with you, I'm not crazy about that scene at all. Just like I wasn't crazy about that other one from yesterday. Ooh, y'all. I haven't really had dinner, y'all. I got, I, I was in bed, like I said, I had to get up. I didn't want, know if I wanted to put on all black. Or did I want to put on... Oh, I don't like that thing sitting up there on top of my head, but I guess it can do for the night. I could turn it to the side. Ugh. Ugh. And I had put this scarf up here. I was going to wear this around my neck. I could still wear it. I got a necklace on, though. I can still I can wear that. I can let it hang out here for, for a minute. Because I ain't going to be up here for that long, y'all. Because, like I said... I'm, I'm still, I still got sleep on me. I really do because I didn't get my nap out. Once I'm wake, I wake, I woke up, you know, uh, I was awakened from my nap. And, you know, I didn't get it out. And so I've been feeling sluggish ever since. Got up and ate some junk food. That didn't help. And this is, look at this. This is home cooked popcorn, you know, like the... Well, I'll show you the one that uh, the ones that have to be cooked on top of the stove. You know how you pop the popcorn back in the day, y'all. Well, that's what I did. I did this. Excuse my kitchen, y'all. Back in the day, popcorn, and I don't like it. <laughs> I mean, let me see. Where's it? Here it is. I had bought this for. So this as a matter of fact was in my stash. It was in my stash. For whatever might pop off. Uh, so I would have this for popcorn anyway. But I still got a couple of packs of Pop Secret over here. But it don't taste right, you know, to me anymore. I don't know what's going on with Pop Secret. Something going on with everything, y'all. And so I decided, okay, tonight I will break the seal on my stash. My popcorn that's in my stash. It's not working for me. I don't know if somebody else might want it. Maybe I just don't know how to cook it anymore. Because it's been so long. It's been like 20, 30, long time since I popped popcorn on top of the stove. It might have been more than 40 years, 50. It's been a long time, y'all. And, you know, and I didn't put no, se there's no seasoning on it. When I got ready to put the seasoning on it, it was the seasoning from the, um, just salt. That's all I put on it. I didn't know what else to do. I said, should I melt some butter and put that on there? I wasn't sure what to do, you know. I think there's some stuff that you could buy to, you know, sprinkle over your homemade popcorn like that. Because that is totally bland. There's no salt, no nothing on it. I, I guess that's why I like Pop Secret so much. Pop Secret was the one, was the one. And uh, now Pop Secret doesn't change. I don't know what happened. 
And even on Amazon, it's cheaper. So you know something when something done popped off with it, if it's cheaper like that. Look at, this is another thing I forgot to mention about this picture. I think those little stockings that are hung by the chimney with care, they look like they're neon. And then they got a couple of Christmas ornaments sitting up there on top of the mantle. I guess that's a mantle, I don't know. And that that is a log burning furniture uh fireplace. See the logs at the bottom? But it looks to me like more like something that you would have out there in your backyard to barbecue on. But nevertheless, it's not a bad scene, but I'm not crazy about it. The only thing I'm really crazy about, maybe the pillows on the chair, you know, that plaid uh, print, that way back in the day print. And then they've got like a rug on the floor with that same print. I like, mmm, sort of like that. And I, of course, I like the backdrop, that uh, background with the trees in the back. Ah. I don't know. I can't decide about that one. I don't like that one that much. But anyway, it's not up to me. I guess they don't care as long as you tune in. And I am tuned into it. So they don't care if I like it or not as long as it's tuned in. Do I look dark tonight? My my picture look a little dark. Maybe because I got on all this black. I got on black from head to toe. Yes, yes, yes. This is what I had on earlier, and then after I got out of bed, I put the same thing right back on. Except I didn't have the scarf. I didn't have the uh, uh, scarf on. I was going to go to the store earlier just to pick up me some canned fruit. I still might go tomorrow. It depends on what the weather is. So how's everybody doing this evening? I'm hanging in there, y'all. I'm doing pretty good. I ain't got no complaints this evening. Just that I need a little bit, just a little bit more rest, and I'd be all right. And I bet you, I'm willing to bet that I'm not going to be able to sleep tonight because, yeah, you know, my sleep was broken. But, uh, whew, excuse me, y'all. And I didn't do my nails. I was going to do my nails before I went to sleep. Don't ask me why I didn't do them, y'all, because I don't know the answer. Has everybody got their Christmas? I guess you say I ask this every night. Have you got your shopping done yet? Today is the seventeenth day of Vlogmas, y'all. Let's see now. Let me make sure I got that correctly and not incorrectly. Yeah, I got it right. It's the seventeenth day of Vlogmas, and therefore, you know, I didn't realize that Christmas is on a Sunday. It's not tomorrow, Sunday, but the week from Sunday, then there it is, y'all. So it means you got, what, six more days until for shopping? I mean, six plus seven is 13. Eight more days. You got eight. But that was last night, wasn't it, that you had eight more days? 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Seven more days, y'all. Seven more days. Got those Christmas presents wrapped? Have you went shopping for the groceries? The, the list that you have made for what are you going to have for on your list? You got all your utensils, your decor. How about your Christmas decor? Do you use Christmas towels in your kitchen? Do you buy Christmas plates and Christmas utensils, Christmas cups, Christmas napkins? How far out on that limb do y'all go? Then tell me how far do you go? Some people go all out now, I'm telling you. I never did because I never could afford it. I mean, frankly, frankly, I could not afford to do all that stuff. But, I mean, it looks nice. I think I one uh, Christmas I did buy... Um, uh, what do you call it? The the this well the bowls that you could use and then toss out after you're done. It's like you know if somebody wanted to carry something home uh, with at Christmas uh, or at uh, Thanksgiving or whatever you know, and then after you you know eat and everything, you pack up your bowl. You pack up a little bowl. They were nice little bowls. 
It was three of them. And I think I took the last one with me on Thanksgiving, you know, out to the uh, house over there on Thanksgiving. And, well, I said I didn't care if I got it back or not. I think they were like three. They were something like the zip lock uh, by Glad, I think. I think they were by Glad. I'm not sure. But they were color. You know, it was gold, like the gold in that tablecloth. The whole thing was a solid gold color. And there was three of them. And I had those for about three, about three years or four years, about three or four years. And each year, somebody takes something home in them, and I never see the bowl again, which I don't care, like I said. You know, because they're so uh, very cheap. But I never bought anything, you know, a whole lot for Christmas. And I have a, a set of Christmas plates. You know, it's a whole set of Christmas plates. You got the four plates, the four cups, the four saucers, the four bowls. My sister had given me many, many years ago, and I've had it all this time. That's the only whole set of dishes that I have. I have a lot of, you know, scattered different uh, plates, different cups, mugs, and all that. But one whole plate, one whole set of plates is so that's the only one I have. And I was gonna put thinking of, I was thinking of putting it out here on the table, but I said, oh no, it's not gonna look right with that tablecloth. So I could probably take my red tablecloth and put it back up there and see how that looks. And I might just do that tomorrow. Because from the looks of things, I'm not going to be able to get no more decor from my house. Which I'm not expecting any company anyway. I haven't heard anything about what anybody else is doing. But I think it's a good idea to sort of stay home with the kids. You know, the kids got toys they want to play with. But I used to let mine take one with them. And a lot of times, you know, I remember my little uh, daughter, she had taken her little drowsy doll with her. Never got it back. And you know those dolls, even then, they weren't dirt cheap. They were not. And they had, like, all of the dolls. You know, like, most of the popular dolls they did have, because I had four girls, after, after all. And um, she never got that back. She never got her peppermint, you know, stocking. She was dressed like a little elf, almost. She had the little striped red and white, you know, uh stockings or I think I don't know if they were stockings or leg warmers I can't remember that far back but I remember that and she said she had spent the night with her cousin and she never got those things back never ever but that's been many many years ago y'all many many years ago who's counting not I I do not like this big thing sitting up here on my head that's why I usually sort of turn it to the side or turn it around to the back. Oh, well, like I said, I wasn't going to be up here that long because I've already been up here about 10 or 15 minutes. And I got to clean things up. And you know what? I still have not packed up those cast iron pans. What am I waiting for? I don't know, but I did get some things out of my bedroom. I got rid of stuff in, out of there. But it's not complete, y'all. Like I said, little bit by little bit. You know, itty weedy bit. That itty weedy bit. And so that's why, you know, when I get through, I'll show you. I will show you how my bedroom looks, which is not going to look all that great because, you know, everything in there is a neat snatch. And I wish I knew how to paint furniture. I would paint those dresses in my bedroom. I think I would go for black. That matte black that everybody's talking about. I think I would go for that. Just paint it. Spray paint. I, th I think they spray paint. I'll tell you the truth. I got to look back on some of the videos and find out how it's done. I think you're supposed to sort of sand the dirt off and, and the, all that kind of stuff and take the hardware off. That much I know. Go inside, wipe inside out, you know, the part that you're going to. Paint, which I ain't painting all the way inside, y'all. I'm just going to do the outside. But that real dark furniture that I got in my room, I don't know. If, uh, I don't know. I'm going to have to go into YouTube. I'm going to have to get the YouTube experts to help me with this one. But anyway, I'm having a great evening, y'all, because I'm not going to go to bed right away. I'm going to play me some Scrabble. 
put those pans in the box. The box is sitting right there, y'all. Right there, three feet away from me. I don't know why I haven't done it. I haven't cooked or nothing like that. I'm going to cook. I'm cooking another dinner tomorrow, hopefully. I'm making steak. Oh, yeah. We're having steak. Well, I'm having steak, rice, and gravy. I haven't decided on vegetables. I probably open up a can of green beans or something. Unless I decide to go to that store, but it's too cold. Like the little Eskimo said, it's too cold outside. They're not going out there on no scooter. I would have went out today, but it went. It usually doesn't bother me. The cold doesn't bother me so much. But when that wind, that wind chill factor is what gets you. So I don't like to go out when it's windy, but it can be cold, you know. As a matter of fact, I've been wanting me a cup of coffee from uh, Duncan. So I don't know if tomorrow is going to be the lucky day or not, y'all. It might be. Because I haven't had a cup of coffee since I complained about the last one. I haven't had a cup of coffee out. You know, I had that nasty coffee I got in there, you know, which is a instant, Folgers instant coffee. And they didn't even have my milk, uh, my organic milk when I went to the store last week. And so I got to, uh, oh, excuse me, I got to uh, uh, get my organic milk. But I got the regular milk. But once you get the taste, get to the, you know, organic milk, it seems like that other milk is just plain old bland. And then besides that, the organic milk lasts a lot longer, you know, than in that um, um, regular whole milk. And I, I, I don't buy the uh, liquid creamer. I have the coffee milk. What you call that? Coffee mate. I buy the. I usually buy the coffee mate. But the liquid creamer is good too. I tell you, it's good. But sometimes I just don't feel like well, paying the money or something. I don't know. But I might pick up some of that if I get out and go to the store. I'm just hoping it doesn't rain tomorrow. I haven't listened to the report yet. But anyway, y'all, I hope you got your reindeer all brushed up and brushed down and got his uh, harness and everything all hooked up to the... Sl I think it's a little too soon to hook that bad boy up to the, to the sleigh. You got to wait a while, but you got to get the saddle up. I don't know if you need a saddle. Not if you got your sleigh in order. I mean, if you got a problem with your sleigh, you might have to ride on that reindeer. But you figure out whether you're going to ride the reindeer or you're going to ride on your sleigh. Which is it going to be, y'all? Is Rudolph going to lead the way? Because you know it might be foggy. You remember that, Sam? You remember that Christmas Eve when Santa didn't, you know, he was too foggy. They couldn't see nothing. But then they remembered Rudolph with his red nose so bright. They used Rudolph. Santa thought about old Rudolph. And Rudolph led the way. Yes, he did. He came through, y'all, I tell you. Just because he had a little formality or uh, something wrong with him didn't mean he didn't have no smarts. Rudolph had it going on up here. And the way he just, woo, he, he dashed on through the snow, y'all. I'm telling you, everybody needs a Rudolph around. If I find one when I go shopping, I'm going to buy me one. Oh, yeah. I, but I don't know if they make them with the red nose or not. I'm, I'm not sure. But they do have a lot of reindeer. They usually have a lot of reindeer on display. Because I see a lot of the YouTubers up there with their reindeer, you know, for the decor. They look so nice, and I want one. But, like I say, my, my apartment is so jammed up, but I'm going to find me a spot for a reindeer, okay? If I see one. And uh, the Dollar Tree is right on the way to, you know, to the store where I, you know, from um, the Dollar Tree is on my, right on my way as I go to the grocery store. So I can, you know, either stop there on my way or stop there on my way back. If anybody's ever been to that Dollar Tree, that Dollar Tree is jam packed with stuff. I just never seen a Dollar Tree. Uh, yeah, a dollar. Uh, it's a family dollar. It's not a Dollar Tree. Now, let, don't get it wrong, y'all, because you know I got it wrong. It's a family dollar that's real junky. 
It's a lot of stuff packed up in that little one little, you know, family dollar. I prefer going to the Dollar Tree, but the Dollar Tree does not, you know, it's not in my, you know, close to me like the dollar, uh, like the family dollar. So, we shall see y'all. We shall see. We're going to get out of this house tomorrow if it doesn't rain. I don't care if it's windy a little bit. The little windy, I can just put on my Santa Claus coat, buckle up real good, jump on my old buzzer ride, and ride. And I go with love. See you tomorrow on the next Vlogmas, y'all. Vlogmas number 18. See you soon.